Ndugu Chancellor is known as many things. World-class funk and jazz drummer, percussionist, composer, producer, three-time Grammy Award nominee, and educator. But it all began with a six-year-old boy in Shreveport, Louisiana, playing cans and oatmeal boxes just because it felt like the right thing to do. It would be an understatement to say that Ndugu was an early achiever. His native talents were honed during his high school years when he was exposed to a handful of jazz greats, mentors, and workshops. This led the young Ndugu, still in high school, into work with Willie Bobo and the Harold Johnson Sextet. Next came studies in music education at California State University, where it became clear there was no stopping this train. Before he was 20, Ndugu had already performed or recorded with Herbie Hancock, Hugh Masekela, Miles Davis, Freddie Hubbard, and Joe Henderson. Ndugu went on to play, record, and compose with a who's who list of artists, including Frank Sinatra, Quincy Jones, Thelonious Monk, Santana, George Duke, Weather Report, Lionel Richie, Tina Turner, John Lee Hooker, and Joe Sample. Notably, it was Ndugu who created the signature groove on Michael Jackson's mega-hit single, Billie Jean, on the top-selling record ever, Thriller. In addition to drumming, Ndugu is heavily involved in writing and producing both his own projects and others, as well as maintaining a busy career as a music educator. He is a professor in the California State University Jazz Studies program, among others, where he greatly enjoys teaching as well as learning from his enthusiastic students. Ndugu has come a long way from drumming on cans to become one of the most sought-after percussionists of all time. But not content to rest on his laurels, he continues to evolve and stay current, raking in some gold and platinum albums along the way. He added the thrill to Thriller, and we're thrilled to have him here with us today.